Good morning everybody. It's Shelly again back to do a video about my work dress barn and we're going to talk about ways to save and coupon and coupon stacking and what you are able to do and what you are not able to do at dress barn if you are interested. Now I am always doing constant hauls on dress barn showing you all of our fashion showing you our great great stuff and I'm in love with the store and a lot of people who had never shopped there once they come in they fall in love with the store um, you can't judge a book by its cover you can't go based on the name you can't think because it's called barn that it's going to be country wear or old people wear or just it is for all ranges of ages we have teenagers up to you know whatever it's for everybody and we have dressy we have casual we have suit pieces we have um a lot of stuff okay a lot of stuff amazing stuff we have accessories shoes petites plus size um plus size 14 through 24 which is a 1x through 3x we have misses sizes 4 through 16 we have short length we have long or tall length on some items and we have a petite section which is petite 4 through um 16 or small through extra large and in some cases they're sending sending us some size twos which is very far in between because we don't normally carry twos so if you are a two my suggestion if you can do petites is to do a petite four which will fit more like a two okay and um <clears throat> so that's just a little bit about our store okay um if you are interested in dress barn but you've never been check out some of my hauls and you will see some of this stuff like I said we have career clothing we have casual we have um, professional <clears throat> professional attire we have funeral wear we have wedding wear um, Vegas clothing I mean we got everything so come check us out and no we are not all dresses like I get some rude comments from customers thinking the whole store will be just dresses no it's not we have everything now the best ways to save at dress barn if you are a dress barn shopper sign up for our credit card I don't care if you like credit I don't care if you're a credit user that is the number one way to save because we are a coupon store we send out thousands of coupons nonstop there is always a coupon and always we have continuing clearance racks we do markdowns once a week so there is always clearance there is always full price most of our coupons are on full price but there is occasionally where we send out our clearance coupons where you can really 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 maximize your savings on 50 percent off or more it won't work on 30 percent but we do 30s 50s 60s sometimes 70s so you want to get it on the everything 50 percent off or more those clearance coupons which come around like once or twice a year now, I know most people these days w refuse to do credit, but that is the best way to save because we give an extra discount for our cardholders. So we will have some coupons that say 25% for cardholder and 20% non-cardholder. So what I suggest to all of my customers and the ones I open the credit card for is you don't have to carry a balance. All you need to do is open the card and on approval, you will save fifty. I'm sorry, you will save ten percent off your total, your total that day, and it's good for the whole day. So no matter what you have clearance or anything, it's ten percent when approved. But your whole purchase will go on that new credit card. Um, occasionally, we do special announcements for fifteen percent off for opening a credit card, and you'll see it on the little billboard that we stick outside our door. At our store anyways and those are occasional um, they're far and be far in between so I wouldn't wait around because I can't even tell you exactly when it comes around but it's like once or twice a year if that um, so you'll want to sign up for the credit card save that 10% and you will want to sign up for um, the blush perks uh, reward card at the time or anytime you come in, Blush Perks Reward Card, the credit card, and you will want to sign up for our texting program. So if you, ha if you have texting on your phone, even if it's a flip phone, 
as long as you get texting, we can do it. Now, the texting, you'll sign up. The code for that one, the person you will send that code to, and I'm gonna tell you how to do it right now, but the key is to wait until you're in the store at the register to do it, okay? Um, you wanna do it when you are in the store or at the register, okay? So the person, the recipient you are sending your text to is gonna be 21226, okay? That's the person you're sending it to, 21226. In your message box, you're gonna type the word style and then hit your send button. It will send you back a text message with a link underlined in blue. You're gonna tap that link, open your web, and you only need your web for a second just to sign you up, okay? So you're gonna open your web on your internet. It's gonna have your phone number with a box next to it. You'll check mark next to that box and hit sign up at the bottom. Next, you will get a text saying, welcome to our texting program. And then right after, you're gonna get a second text with your first code in it. And you will save 20% off one regular price item that day, the minute you sign up. So you wanna make sure you have at least one regular price item when you sign up. Okay, so you'll receive 20% off and it's gonna take it off your highest item, your highest full price item. So you'll get 20% off if you combined, this is how I do it, to stack savings. I tell people to combine. So when you apply for the credit card, you can, you can use that text with it, okay? So you'll get the 10% on approval plus the 20% off your highest price item. So there you just stacked two coupons, basically. If you're looking for a deal like me, this is how I explain it to my customers. And we are in Southern California, my store, okay? So you will stack your new credit card 10% plus your 20% single regular price item, okay? So there's a really good deal right there. You will sign up for your Blush Perks reward. And what that is, is every point you get, there's 10 points, okay? Every point is worth $25 that you've spent. So if you spent 50, you're getting two points that day. As soon as you fill up all 10 points, which is $250, it's gonna print you a $15 reward at the register, a paper receipt. It is a coupon, people. Um, I have so many customers thinking it's just a receipt, crumbling it, throwing it in their purse, and then later, months later, complaining to us about where's their coupon. Um, you got your coupon the minute you earned it, whatever. If you lose your coupon once you've earned it, that's on you. That's, it's your responsibility to keep a hold of your coupon. And it is a little confusing because it looks like a receipt, but it is not a receipt. It's a little receipt size paper about this big with a barcode through the center, okay? So you want to keep that with your reward card. I always tell everybody, we always tell everybody at our store to wrap it around your card, okay? Wrap it around your card so when you go to use your card each time you shop, you'll see you have a coupon because it's good for 90 days, okay? Now, here's a different way to save. So there's only two options for stacking, the brand new credit card or the reward card. The reward card is going to stack with every coupon out there except for senior discount. If your store offers a senior discount, okay? So, the $15 off coupon is combinable with all your other coupons. So let's say you have a 25% off in your phone for all your regular price, okay? So you're gonna, you're gonna wait, and what I like to do is I ring everybody up, give you the full total before any coupons, then I say, do you have any coupons? You're going to show me the coupon text in your phone. Yes, you have to show us your phone. We have to read your text because Certain coupons have to go on your, your dress brand credit card. If you just give us the code, we don't know, we'll put it in, we can get in trouble if we don't process your payment correctly or your discount correctly. So do show your phone. You have to have your phone. You can't just give us a code. 
Okay, show us your phone or show us your printout paper for your coupons. Um, they need to be present with you. So show your phone, you'll get that coupon, the 25% off your total, and then the $15 reward comes after and it comes off your total, okay? $15 comes off everything, clearance everything, where the other one's just gonna come off a of full price. So um, a lot of people complain about the register receipt that they can't find where their $15 came off. Let me explain that really quick. When we take your $15 printout coupon off, what it does is it separates, it divides your $15 by how many items you're getting, okay? So if you're getting five items, it's going to divide five into 15 and it's going to take that amount off each item, okay? So you'll see it off, you'll look underneath each item and you'll see blush perk, blush perk, blush perk, blush perk. That's how you know your coupon was received, okay? And next to where it says blush perk, it tells you how much was taken off that item. So it splits it between how many items you have. It's just a little division there. So that way when you return your item, you're, if you're returning one item, you get minus that amount, okay? So it already does it for us. So if that makes any sense. Now, if you return every single thing on that receipt, it's gonna reprint you back your $15 coupon. It never did that before, but now it gives it back to you. So if you're returning your whole receipt, it won't do it if it's just a couple items or one item. It has to be the whole receipt. If you return that whole receipt and you're expecting your $15 reward card back, I mean your coupon back, just do a simple return and then repurchase your new stuff, okay? If you want that coupon back, because some people complain, where'd my coupon go? I want my coupon back. Well, you have to return your items to get that coupon back because you did use it, you redeemed it. So, okay, so return everything and it reprints back out to you and then you can use it towards your next purchase if that makes sense, okay? But if you're just doing an exchange and it's the same exact item, you're gonna get it for exactly what you paid, okay? In exchange, you get it for the same amount, which means you don't have to worry about your reward because you're gonna get it with that price that you spent. So I hope that makes sense to all of you. What I suggest you do, and our, our um, credit card bank is amazing. It's Comna, Comnity Bank, okay? Or Comnity Bank, however you would say that. They are amazing. They do Dress Barn, they do Victoria's Secret, they do Pure One, they do Buckle. Okay, so within that bank, they have all those great store credit cards. And those are all my favorite stores. So um, I am rebuilding credit, and here's a quick little story for you, for those of you who think you won't get the card. And um, it is a really good re a bank rebuilding card. Like if you're rebuilding credit, and I've had even bankruptcy and everything, if you're rebuilding, try for the card anyways because if you have a lower score they're just gonna give you a lower amount some people are just straight out denied for whatever reason but the majority of people who have been rebuilding or you know it works for most like i get very little turndowns i do get some but i'm not gonna lie but the the majority of the people who say they won't get it actually get it when they apply and so you always want to apply. If you shop at Dress Barn, please apply. And not for us, but for you, it's going to save, it's going to let you stack. I mean, not only that, but you you don't have to come out of pocket right at that second unless you want to pay it off right then and there. Okay, so you can do your payments in store, online, or by mail. Do, do not do it by phone because it's up to $15, I heard in Southern California. That's just a suggestion right there. Don't waste money like that. If you think you can't get in, get your payment in on time, walk it in. Just do it in store. It's my best suggestion. It will credit you that day. Do it in store. Okay, so, and you know, of course, they mostly say before five. 
So try to get in before five on the day it's due in store. So those are my great coupon stacking tips, okay? Texting program, reward program, and credit card. A credit card app when you first apply. You won't get discounts just for using your credit card unless you have a coupon. Like a lot of people say, can I save money just for putting it on my card? No, only if there is a coupon out at that moment, okay? So remember, don't forget, <clears throat> don't forget your coupons. Stack them, stack your reward cards, your blush perk reward card, your, your printouts. Now, if you're somebody who comes in maybe two times a year and you spend like a thousand each time, which we have those ladies that hate to shop that only come in twice a year and they spend a little over a thousand each trip, they will have a stack of reward coupons. You can use several of them in one purchase. If you're getting four of them, or, you know, it just has to be the, the value amount of the $15 times four. That's how much you have to spend to use them all. So, you know, if you have two, you need to spend $30, and then you're going to get those items for free, okay? So it has to be at least the amount and right now we are doing DB dollars, which is running out. And right now you're earning them and you're going to keep earning them until the 27th. So what you are doing is um, when you are coming into our store right now and shopping, every 25 you spend before tax, you are getting a DB dollar per 25, okay? So if you're at 100 before tax, you're getting four coupons for our upcoming sale, which is starting July 28th, okay? So we staple them to your receipt, and if you get a $15 reward at the same time for your next purchase, because it is good for 90 days, what I suggest to you is saving it and using it in the time frame with the DB dollars and stack your coupons. Now, if you have four DB dollars, this is how you use them because I get this question a lot also. And I might be confusing some of you, but I'm telling you the ins and outs of Dress Barn and the best way to save as an employee, me telling you, we want you to save. We want your business. We are about our customers. So if you have four DB dollars, okay, you need to spend a hundred dollars, okay? You will, if you're combining them, wait, let's see. You'll need to spend $100 and it takes off those. And then, okay, wait, I lied. If you're, okay, it's not going to be $100. Let's say if you have $130 you're spending, you would need to spend $130 in this scenario to use all these coupons. You would need to spend $130 at least, right? And if you had two D, um, if you had two reward printouts and four coupons, which they're five off twenty-five, what you would need to do is spend one hundred and thirty. We take the two fifteen dollars off right off the top, and then the four coupons come off the hundred. So when you're doing it like that, it's always going to take the reward off first. So. If you're stacking, remember, you can't spend 100 give your four coupons, and then get $30 off that, that total. No, no, no. You would have to spend 130 just to let you know. 130 okay? 130 it takes the 30 off instantly. And then that leaves you with the 100 enough to use all of your remaining coupons. Otherwise, it's going to cut you short and not accept one of your coupons. If you do it the $100 and give your four coupons and then try to use your blush perks, it's going to knock off half your coupons. It's not going to do it. You have to take off the, the reward coupons first and then the other ones. Okay, so happy shopping at Dress Barn. I hope you enjoyed my tips on saving and the ins and outs and our programs and um, our coupon stacking and everything else. And a reminder again, this is a Southern California store that I work at. I'm not sure 
if it is uh, we have stores throughout the state so I'm not sure check with your local but as far as I know they're all the same in the way they do it okay I'm not sure I mean I know your blush perks works everywhere but double check okay as far as I know it's the same everywhere but don't quote me on that because I don't live over there I just know what we do okay but um, yeah happy shopping at dress barn come in and see us and oh yes one more reminder we have an online ordering system in store so if your size is not in store bring your item that you want to the register ask us to check if it is online and order you your size you will pay that day instantly when we do it if it is available and you can opt for shipping it to our store for free or you can opt to ship it to your house and it'll charge you a shipping a shipping fee okay and then if you ever need to return the item you purchased online once it comes as, as soon as it comes it takes seven to ten business days we call you once it's in our store you will get an email telling you when your package is in because you have to use an email to do online ordering if you don't have one we do have a default one that we use okay um, and also you need to pay with a credit card or a gift card there's no cash debit because it is online you couldn't pay cash ordering something online at home I mean that's common sense and so many people come in why can't I pay cash um, think about that question please before you come up to me at the desk and ask that because that is a very stupid question everybody knows you cannot pay cash you cannot just stick cash into your computer and pay online so you can't do it in the in, in store either okay it has to be on a card so come in and see us um come in and see us if you're doing the return on the item that got shipped in you will need to bring your packing slip with your return okay if you had it shipped to your house, shipping fees are not returnable, only your actual item. Just so you know, because we have people giving us grief about that also. It states on there, I, it's you're not gonna get back your shipping cost, you're not. So we always suggest that you have it shipped to us for free, so if you ever need to return it, you get back everything you paid. Quick tip for another saving money at Dress Barn. If you're having it ordered online ship it to our store for free when you're doing in-store and online sometimes from home they offer that also uh, with a discount like they'll say oh free shipping to store right now it's not always it's just sometimes so keep an eye out we have a lot of people who order from home that live locally and they just come and pick it up once it comes to our store because it's free for them free shipping so keep your eyes out we have deals everywhere people dress barn deals come shop come see us love you enjoy bye